I had that the ibis just came. I had that the ibis just came in. See, I had that the ibis. Look, look. The bird that has been chewing my my bean sprouts. You see. Look at this. Had that the ibis. It's back. It's the bird that has been chewing. Oh my! Look at this. Uh huh. Ah! Bug spray is ready. Should have gotten the Hadada ibis with this. <laughs> oh my god! Let's go try this in the garden. That bird gave me a bad scare, and it's the one that has been chewing my beans. Let me just show you my beans. I planted some beans that I want to enjoy when they are still green. I don't want the pods to dry up. I want to harvest them once the, the pods are filled up and they are still green. And I'm going to harvest. But look at what that bird has been doing. See, look at my beans. You see? Look at this. But now... This bird is just bad news and it's so big. If you <laughs> I don't know how I can I need to get a new camera soon to upload to upload clearer videos so that you can see how big the bird is. You can enjoy better pictures. So here is our bird spray. So see So I think I, I will also spray this bean so that when it comes to the beans, <laughs> it will get some bitter leaves and just leave it and go. So you're going to be using this spray. Uh, time it when it's not so hot because you don't want to come and spray your plants when the sun is so hot. Either very early in the morning or late in the evening when the sun has gone down. Just the same way you would water. You don't come and water your plants when the sun is so hot. So let's do some spraying here. You see? Here there's some shade. Hello and welcome to another interesting episode here at 254 Nature Grass. My name is Julie. I still have the flower craze. <laughs> Today we have uh, a female and male open. At the same time, on one zucchini. I've only seen that happen once in the third zucchini, but it's always a female or a male open. But here is our zucchini. Look, look at this. Look at these fresh leaves coming through. But then, if you come closer, pests. So in this video, after we harvest our zucchini, I want to show you how to scout your plants and what you can use to keep the pests away. Yes, look at this. They are coming at high speed. <laughs> Another big one. And this one looks like a butter zook. <laughs> look at the shape. <laughs> Perfect. Look. Wow. Grow some zucchini at home. We are harvesting this zucchini right here. I hope you can see it well. <laughs> this is great. Second zucchini. So I need to use a knife just to cut. Get it. Woo! Yeah. This is it. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this, friends. Is 
Isn't this just lovely? Harvesting big zucchinis at home. Talk of vitamin A, vitamin B in zucchinis. This fruit, it grows so fast. So if you have plenty of zucchini plants in your garden, you are assured you have food. Look at this. Healthy and nice. <laughs> Woo! So far I have two of them. So I harvested using a knife so that I can have this top part. Share with me some nice recipes in the comment section because now we have two big zucchinis that I want to cook and make in the kitchen, make something nice. But as you have seen, this is a super plant to have in your garden. If you're just looking for different plants that you should have at home to, as a source of affordable food. So because I don't have a big plantation of zucchini, one way to deal is with pests is also just to remove them by hand. So look at this. So this here, I'm just going to remove it. You see? See this? Let's come down here and check what it is. So it's a worm. So this leaf here, it's not exposed to the sun. Look closely. See where it's hiding. Look at this. Look at this. So I'll remove it by hand. So this is our spray from the fridge. It's cold. <laughs> Remember I told you to store it in the fridge because it's food. You open up the nozzle. So I'm going to go through all the leaves and the stem just spraying on it. Since it does not have any chemicals, it's safe enough to use during this time. It's working well. I'm actually spraying and the insects are jumping. I don't know if I can bring you close so that you can see the insects jumping. Are they? This is potent, so just keep it away from the eyes. Even if I cop their food substances, so it's, it's not harmful, but just keep it away from your eyes. So I can't do it using one hand. Let me just place you down.
Our zucchini is well sprayed. If you're new here, remember to subscribe to support me. It goes a long way to helping me reach more people. Don't be afraid of using the potent organic pest spray. It will not harm your body. Just It will just irritate your eyes or your throat because of the ingredients in it. But it's not harmful. So don't be afraid and you can use it when your plants are fruiting and flowering. Join me in the next episode as I share more tips on how to grow affordable food at home and gardening. Thank you and thank you for your support. Let's create a food and garden heaven. Oh, that's done.